Welcome back to another community. What? Welcome back to another community spotlight. Today we're taking a look at Little Roll and D Wolf SK's Aqua Dynamics, the Navigator 40 meter research multi purpose vehicle. Vessel. You know what I meant. Let's get started. Alright, so this is the Aqua Dynamics, the Navigator 40 meter research multi purpose vessel. It's a very long name. I think it's called the Navigator, but all the other stuff is like the company name and how big it is and what it does. So we have a little bitty submarine in there, out there, and under the water we have a diving bell. So these are add-ons that you can download. See, it's down there. And what we're going to try to do is first get this submarine onto the ship, and then we'll try to figure out how to get <laughs> the diving bell back up onto the ship as well. Okay, so first let's go ahead and jump into this little guy. I think we want to back it up. So I'm going to go ahead and open this. Turn this off right now. Because I don't want those magnets. Magnet, 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 magnet thing, anything. I don't think that's a real word. Where is the hatch? Hatch? Is there a hatch? Am I scared? I'm going to die. Okay, number one is hatch. Number one is hatch. There we go. All right. So let's go ahead and can we back up? I don't think we can back up. Switch throttle? Maybe that's it. It's not really switching. Hmm. Switch throttle. Switch to throttle. Okay. All right. So that doesn't really back. There's no reverse. Throttle steering up, down. So there is no reverse. So maybe we go in frontwards? I thought we had to pull it on backwards, but maybe not. So, okay. We will go ahead and try to turn this around. Very slowly, because I'm a very bad driver. And we will try to get this on the back of the ship. So there's, see those tracks? We've got these little tracky things down here, and so we are going to try to pull it onto the boat and hopefully get it on the back, tie it down however you tie it down, and then try to find the diving bell. So that is the mission for this spotlight, and if I can do that, I will feel good about myself. Okay, come on, keep turning. So here we go, going forward, going forward, going forward. And there it says navigator right there, so that is the name of the ship. Okay, so now we're going to go ahead and throw it down. It's not throwing down. Ah! Okay. So we hit the back of the ship. It's probably not the best thing to do, but the good news is we kind of. Oh, I got out of there. We kind of have it right in the right spot. So let's close this off. What are those buttons for? Disconnect. Okay, so we're gonna turn this on now. That little thing right there is a like electric connection or a magnet or whatever. And so we have this right here. And so we're gonna come back and try to get inside there. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. Okay. So the submarine is down where we can't see it. So we're gonna use this slider. What does this letter do? Oh, okay. That seems useful. Okay, how do we... Oh, crane. Okay. So let's go ahead and push the crane a little bit forward. Okay, wait, what? Right? Yeah, right about there, I think, is good. Now let's lower something. How do we lower? Okay, number two is low. Okay. How do you turn on the magnet? Three. Oh, okay. That was easier than I thought. Okay, wedge it up then. Okay, it's not exactly perfect, but <laughs> now we need to get it on the tr the. Uh... Oh, that's the wrong thing. That's not that. That's not what we want. I want this to pull it back. Oh, look, it's backwards. All right, so that's pretty good, right? So how do we get it? How do we? Oh, what's this? Cabin lights, slider mag. Okay, well that seems good. I don't, I don't know. Maybe it's. Maybe they have to like, touch the tracks or something? I don't know. I don't know. Let's see here. Um, here. Go ahead and get on there. Get on the track. Get on, get on the track. Oh, nuts. Get on. Okay, I don't feel like this is working. What if I like let go? How about if I let go? Let go of this one? No, it's starting to get dark. Let's not do dark. All right, so we got this on the track. Huh. I know there's a way to do this. I just don't know how. What does this do? In, out. Well, that might be useful, right? Pull it, pull it. Where's it connect? I don't know what connects. Not useful. Maybe that's for the diving 
bell. I don't see anything to connect this to. Well, there's that. Hmm. Let's go back in here. Maybe there's something I'm missing. So we have slider mag off, slider mag on. That is way too much text. I can't read that. Okay, uh, let's see here. Okay. Uh, okay. Definitely not the right way to do this. Okay, cool. So let's back on the deck farther. So maybe we can go ahead. What the heck, door? Maybe we can go ahead and pop it on now. Okay. Ugh. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, come on. There must be something wrong with you. Ugh. Uh, what the heck? Just stick on it. Hmm. I don't know. What's the deal here? Okay. Make sure not off when in use. Okay, well, it's on. Still not turning these on. I feel like... Ugh. Come on, come on. Come on, come on. Ugh. What the heck? See, those are... They're right on the tracks. I feel like they should work. Okay, so... Is there anything I'm missing here? What, what's down here? <gasps> There's a magnet down there, right? No? Yeah, there is. Where is that thing? Is that the thing? Alright, let's, let's go ahead and grab it and put it... Put it there? Oh, does it have to be on? I don't know. I don't use these things. <sighs> hey! Look at that. That worked. Let's go ahead and pull it in. Tighten up. Tighten up! You don't even have to get on the tracks so you don't want. Oh, 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 is it on the tracks? Oh, it is on the tracks. Yay, that's a win. That is totally a win. Okay, so now the diving bell is right down there. See that? Okay, so what we got to do now is move this little boat forward. Now, in the directions, it says you literally just have to push forward. You don't have to do anything fancy with the engines, I think. I've never been on this boat, so I don't know. But, apparently I can't find a way in either. Uh, can't open that door. Let's see here. Let's go down here again? Might as well check it out while we're doing this, right? Okay, so let's come back here and see what they have inside. Okay, so we got this. Got the corridor. Goes all the way down. Lots of artwork and stuff. Very nice. What's this say? Captain's cabin. Ooh, nice work. And then we have... Like a... Is this like a, what does it say? Does it say something? XO Gavin. Okay, cool. And then we have engine room, I assume, down there. Okay, I'm going around in circles now. Is there any more doors on this side? <gasps> oh, wow, look at that. That looks nice. Just the layout and the little fluid filter things. And, oh, wow. That is really nice. What is this, by the way? Just for looks. <laughs> What's going on here? So, throttle at idle. Okay, isolate power to generators to power the batteries without moving. No, we don't want to do that. Anchor down, anchor up. Okay, so literally it says push W to go forward. Look at this. Thing. Oh! No way. Okay, how do you stop? This is a cool ship. I don't know how it works, but it's cool. All right, so are we cool? Uh -huh. Are we cool? I feel like this is like a Tesla ship. There's no uh, motor sound. Oh, 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 to figure out how everything works. I just want to see if I can get the diving bell onto the ship and leave it up to you to go ahead and play with this ship on your own game. So let's see what we can do here. We have that over there. And we're going to go ahead and lower. 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 Mm, that's right. It is for the little mag too. So, down it goes. Alright, and now I'm going to go down there in my non-diving equipment body and hook it to the diving bell. I think. Does it have to be on? I never know. Do they both have to be on? I think they both have to be on, right? So, there must be a button on this thing to turn it on. Oh, they don't have to be both on. I lied. Okay, let go of that. Let's go back up here, and stop it from going down. Pull it back up. Now, what would be really cool, I don't know if this is the way it works, but what would be really cool is if 
there's a composite connection through that connector. And if I go in the diving bell, I can control the um, the wench to go down. So I could sell out, get in the diving bell, and then control the diving bells from inside. Does that make any sense? So let's try it. So first let's get this thing up in the air. And we're going to go ahead and come back here and see if it's coming up. Oh, did I hit the wrong button? Oh, no! Oh. All right, so a lot of bad things happened. A lot of bad things are still happening. So the game crashed. Oh. All right, so I had a lot of trouble. The uh, I hit the wrong button. I hit R and took it back to the workshop, and at the same time, the game crashed. So the submarine is back off, and we're going to leave it back off. And there is a diving bell. And we are going to grab that diving bell and bring it back on board by itself. Forget the uh, the uh, <laughs> submarine because I can't do it again. All right, so we're going to go ahead and... Oh, I almost hit the wrong button again. We're going to go ahead and lower it. Let's see here. Number two. And we're going to turn number three on. So it's going down. We're going to give it some rope. And we're going to hit number two two and now we're gonna go down there and we're gonna stick it on that thing and we are going to bring it up and then we're gonna see if it has a composite connection on the inside and if I can control it because that would be awesome okay so the diving bell is on this time that seemed like it was off last time maybe I'm crazy okay well here we go so I'm gonna go ahead and stick it on all right let go and we want to hit number one, I think, when we get back in the boat. Bring it up. All right, let's bring it up. Number one. Okay. All right. Come on, number one. Pull it, pull it, pull it. Okay. That's number one. Okay, we're going to bring it back. Okay, so there, look, it has tracks. Can't really turn it sideways, can I? It's not really connecting. Oh, there it goes. So let's see if if we can get inside it and we can control things, because that would be awesome. All right, we got, oh, it's rolling. Okay, so disconnect. Is there a way inside this thing? Disconnect. Hatch. Wait, where's the hatch? Is it underneath? Oh, I can't get inside! Uh, okay, I think I'm disappointed a little bit. I don't think that I can do anything with it. Oh. Alright, let's go forward. I should fall off the rails. Okay, there we go. Okay, here we go. By the way, look at this wood floor. Is that not cool? That is cool. All right, so let's go underneath here. And... All right. Up, down, lights. <gasps> it does look like we can do it. Oh, this is going to be so cool. Okay, let's go ahead and head out into the ocean. And if this works, it's going to be so awesome. I cannot believe this. I, like, I didn't think that it would have this feature, but I was hoping it had this feature. Again, we don't need to do anything except go forward. And this little guy starts moving. Nice looking ship, though. Look at that. Nice colors. Nice looking work on the whole radar system and all that stuff. Oh, look at that. It's got a little thing on the bed. Now, this is going to be cool. So we're going to go back outside to... Oh, there we go. Go back outside to the diving bell. And hopefully we can get inside it without too much trouble. So I'll come down here. And, oops, come in through the bot. Whoop. Ugh. Come in through the bot. Come in through the bottom. Is there something I can grab onto in here? I don't see a handle. Is there a handle? Oh, well, I popped in for a second. I'm, uh, okay. Okay, where's the door shutter? I can find that. Where's the door shutter? Ah, oh, I think it's the door shutter right there. Okay, so let's try that again. Uh-huh. All right, so if I lower it into the water more, is that going to help me? I don't know. I'm not going to drown, but 
I don't know. Alright, so, oops, it's getting dark. Let's go ahead and adjust that time zone. Alright, so let's go ahead and try to put it a little bit lower. And here we go. Into the water. The good news is we're inside. Bad news is there's water inside. Is there a, is there a hatch button? Pumps? Alright, there's pumps. Um, huh. I don't see anything. Lights. Up, down. But I don't see a door control. Is there a... Um, oh, I'm drowning in here if I was alive here. Okay, where's the door control? So the door control is right there. So can I get to the door control from in here? Probably can, right? Uh, huh. There must be a hash button that I can touch through the wall, maybe? Oh, there it is. Wow, that button is in a really not good place. Okay. So, the pumps are on, right? Get the water out. Okay, well, let's try to bring it up, maybe? Alright, I feel like we got somewhere here. So we're out of the water. The door is shut, right? Why do I feel like the door is not shut? I feel like something's broken. Uh-oh. Mm -hmm. Warning can be very glitchy if hatch is closed while someone is in the diving belt. Okay, well, I, I don't really know what to do then, because the diving bell's for diving, and you need to get inside, and you need to shut the door, right? So... I guess it's broken. All right, well, there doesn't even look like there's a window there, does it? Looks like there's only one window, there's a hole. Maybe this is broken. All right, well, the point is that I wanted to do is I wanted to just see if you could control the controls, and you can. And that's like the best part right here is you can actually go underwater and control the diving bell. And I'm swimming inside because there's water inside, but that is cool. So, it looks like this boat is, like, halfway to being completed, and there's just, like, some little things that need to be tweaked. And hopefully they can get those tweaks done, and then this will be awesome, because I really wanted to go ahead and get in here and go down underneath the water and, like, look at the fish and all that cool stuff. Alright, so this has been The Navigator by Little Roll and D Wolf SK. And you can find the link in the description to this ship. You can check it out. It has very cool features, a very cool look. And go ahead and leave a comment on their workshop page and let them know you checked it out. That's it for today. I'll see you next time. It's a float by.